Hey Virgos, welcome and welcome back to the channel. Thank you guys so much for being here and showing all your love and support. Happy birthday, y'all. It's Virgo season. Let's tap into the messages real quick. Sun, moon, Venus rising. Be sure to tap in when you can. I had a weird dream. And I usually don't dream like daily or every other day, it's sporadic. But when I do, it's kind of like an omen. Somebody here wants you to spill tea on your spiritual gifts for whatever reason, or they want to know to what, high, what ranking you are at in the spiritual realm. I feel like somebody here wants to find ways to, um, to be rid of you they don't want you to get your flowers or want you to receive anything spiritually somebody here wants you to underachieve like i don't know it was kind of like a small intimate gathering i couldn't make out the faces of the people i don't know if they're family members friends or um whatever this is or just um people that you are in the same rooms with um, I don't know if this is going to be of any use to you, but that's what I picked up in my dream. Like somebody is going to be um, very open with somebody that they feel comfortable with or carry some, some type of energy, like a therapist or someone that is easing you into speaking up or saying too much. Less is more is what I heard, okay? What's the message here? Okay, so we have the Seven of Cups in reverse. That took long enough to get to this, this card here. We have the Death card at the bottom of the deck to the Eight of Cups. I feel like somebody could be, somebody could be forced to stay somewhere when you're close to the end of a cycle. I feel like there's a lot of productivity around work, a project or something that needs to be done. I feel like you got a lot to do and you're going to get justice. Something is gonna be balanced on both sides. I feel like whatever it is that you're dealing with legally, you're gonna be very productive to build your case. I'm telling you six of wands, it's gonna go very well here. When it comes to societal um, situations, you're going to win something here. The Seven of Cups speaks up on like realizations. Okay, somebody's gonna be realizing a lot of things or you're gonna be minimizing the options that you have because you know of which option is the best one for you. Okay, I hope it's not a past person or a past situation although it could be, or maybe you're choosing between a past situation or something that seems hard to let go of and a potential lover or somebody that you're dating. Somebody definitely is trying to uncomplicate a situation or make sense of some sort of like chaos. Yeah, somebody is moving away from the chaos. Somebody is moving away from the indecisive energies, okay? I see friendship, soul tribe, you know, emotions being shown. Somebody here may be, uh, somebody here is very open about their their friendship with a, a older masculine. Somebody here that's disciplined, has their own uh, business going on. They could be an entrepreneur, um, is a family man. Okay, five of swords here. This could be a father figure or somebody that is your, your father biologically. Doesn't have to be. This could be uh, your boss as well. This is somebody that takes great care of their kids <clears throat> or they take pride in their children. They strive to make sure that their children are the best versions of themselves here. Somebody's very active in their children's lives. Yeah, 10 of cups. Somebody could be married, 
whoever this Aries is. What's the Seven of Cups? What is this realization for Virgo? What's the realization for Virgo? Okay, this is in the cross position. I'm going to um, pull another card. What's this King of Swords to the Seven of Cups? It looks like somebody is still trying to figure something out or something is not clear enough for a person. Somebody could be on edge or wake up that way. I feel like somebody here could also be in this I don't care type of energy because they can't use their intellect to um, control a situation or be immoral to somebody. Okay, there's a judgment. So somebody is evaluating to something they are awakening to. I feel like there's definitely some type of injustice in regards to an opportunity when it comes to love. Somebody here may be trying to drag you apart from the person that you are coming into a connection with because we did see the lovers here. You are, you are free to discover whatever routes you are taking to be with somebody. Okay, but somebody is somebody here wants you to feel overwhelmed, emotional. Somebody wants you to seek counsel or feel like you need to. Okay, I feel like you are needing to put your, your foot down. I heard power bottom. Okay, we have strength. You could be dealing with a Libra, heavy Libra, water sign, or air sign. Heavy Libra is significant. Somebody could have came at you sideways and you've made the decision that, you know, they're only trying to get all up in your, your business or come towards you for something. Like, why did they never make a, uh, the decision to come towards you before? Somebody is definitely trying to hold you back from healing from some sort of love connection or friendship that you have healed from so that you won't go towards somebody new, okay? They're trying to throw a monkey wrench in your love connection or dynamic that you may be inclined to take. here message for Virgo okay this card wants to show up so we have hero or heroine Somebody could be working on something that they need to do for themselves. Personal empowerment is significant. Somebody's learning to transcend to serve themselves or for a cause. But they feel like they're being smothered by a um, non-motherly person. Somebody that may not have been able to be around their biological children. Okay. Okay. Somebody thinks that you need to, somebody, it looks like somebody thinks that you're trying to free yourself from them so that they, you won't have to share this benevolent, godly energy with them. They, they think that you're very mystic. You carry this mystical energy. Okay. They want to know more about you. They see that you have um, compatibilities of, of a warrior. A warrior goddess, you are a warrior goddess here. That's crazy, okay? You you pick and choose who you guide, okay? You you are being called to, to guide those that um, are very um, ignorant or um, very gullible, like children, okay? You serve for, for children here to lead them to the right path or put them on the right path journey so that they will not be sabotaged like you were. You help those that you see yourself in. I'm 
telling you that's the dream that I had. Somebody is trying to find out what sort of ranking or get you to talk. I'm telling you, detective. Somebody's trying to get you to talk, man. To say where you come from, what type of relationship or connection you you came from here. I'm telling you. This could be a um, middle-aged masculine that has a lack of, of visions, okay, or um, report to the divine. This is somebody that sells your insights to the highest bidder, compromising your vision to make it more acceptable. I'm telling you, somebody want to turn something around on you so that it turns into a negative, so that you will not be given your flowers. That's what I'm getting here. And you seem to be the hero. Somebody doesn't like the fact that no matter which way they turn, right, left, up, down, diagonal, horizontally, it's like you still fit the description of somebody that is of the divine. You could be a spiritual engineer. You create new energy for practical expression. You have a talent for designing um, resolutions to common dilemmas. Okay, I'm telling you, you are an alchemist. And somebody trying to take you out to destroy you, they trying to use destructive power to do this here. When you show up as a hero, it's bothersome that you show up as some type of hero. for Virgo. All right, so overall we do see here that there is a door that's going to become available to, for you to walk through it. You have an opportunity that's waiting for you so that changes can be applied to your life. I see that you may be getting some type of advice or somebody wanting to reach out or contact you here. Look, we have Valley that's showing up. There's a deep personal strength and peace that assures success. Tell me more about this Valley card for Virgo. We have the bell. It looks like you're making it through some really tough times, you know, some high Valley energy. Okay, you're going through a transformation on a personal level, you're going to um, get an announcement of somebody that may want to spend uh, more time with you. Okay, this could be somebody from your past. It doesn't have to be somebody you were in a relationship with. This could be a, a, an old friend of yours. Okay, or somebody here is going to find you on a social media platform and try to reconnect. Or this could be... Um, a, a biological parent or somebody that you're it seems like you guys are in a foreign space okay they feel like because you're reaching this arc arc way energy where you're you have new opportunities possibilities and paths opening up that they could try to make it right with you at this time what a very convenient time for somebody to try to come in to reconcile with you I feel like somebody could even be catching an attitude like, what is the problem? Why does it have to be a coincidence that I come in to want to fix things with you? What a damn coincidence. In all your days, there are 365 days in a year and you want to come now? I'm telling you, Libra is significant. Okay, somebody here could be um, considering suicide or, or somebody could be suicidal here. Okay, somebody feels like a person is going to leave them alone, which is making them desperate. I'm telling you, somebody's trying to silence you or um, use empty promises, bribery, money, manipulation to get answers from you about your spiritual position. A crooked cop could be involved or a police department. Let's see. Message for Virgo. Okay, so somebody here could be on the registry. They could be a registered sex offender. Okay. 
okay? Whoever this uh, registered sex offender is, they could have slept with their hairstylist or somebody that um, touches them up, whether they have dreads, braids, or whatever their hair is, the, the barber or whoever this is. Somebody could be erasing or deleting files, pictures, or anything so that nobody knows what's going on behind the scenes, okay? Somebody cheated on their person, all right? Somebody here could be a light worker, Somebody cheated on a light worker and passed judgment on them due to the fact that they are not um, biologically um, aligned with a, a child, okay? Somebody could be using your personal info to, to fix their car problems. Somebody could be using your credit card information. You're wondering why this person's not taking your call or why they're so inadequate with answering the phone. That's crazy. Let's see here. What's the message? Be careful sleeping with somebody that may be cheating on you or you even suspected. Whoever this person is, they ain't got a job or somebody's losing their job. There was some sort of animal sacrifice that a person used to try to make you um, lose position and where you work or whatever this is. Look, Grand Theft Auto, somebody here could be trying to um, steal a person's vehicle or means to, tr to um, transport places. We have female friends. Somebody thinks that taking you away from the things that allow you to move quicker is going to stop any show. Okay, the show must go on. Drinking or drug problems. Somebody does something under the influence or uses that to do things because they see that you're happily walking away from them. Okay? Yeah, straight up like that. All right? Tell me more. What's the message for Virgo? Yeah, somebody was only looking out for their best interest while they were dealing with you, okay? And it looks like you could have um, found this out and you're really angry. Now this could be leading to irreconcilable differences where you break up with this person. Somebody's going to receive bad karma for what they've done to you and all you had to endure, okay? There's something about a pharmaceutical company. Maybe one of your family members worked there. I feel like somebody could be coming to work with a black eye, um, a bruised arm, uh, marks on their neck, okay? I'm hearing somebody could have been bitten or it looks like bite marks or maybe some sort of like inflicted wound from somebody else. I don't know, somebody here could be crazy enough to cause it on themselves just to get somebody to, to be out of their life, okay? Or somebody here is into rough play, foreplay, or whatever this is. Sorry, y'all, I'm trying to get these cards out. Here, a Virgo. Okay, so we got a deceased mother. Somebody's mother is deceased, and if your mother's not deceased, there's some sort of like death within this person, or somebody here is um, it's like they're transcending who they are now to evolve on a spiritual level. I feel like somebody here could be sending you smoke and mirrors or telling you um, things that may not even be true. Somebody here may need to get a blood test in order to um or or see this this person in the morgue to know that this this mother is is passed away or something like that here i'm gonna pick one more rejection is your protection so if you've been walked away from or somebody has ghosted you or stopped communicating rejection is your protection currently yeah somebody used you for their own selfish gain or selfish reasons this could be somebody with virgo or somebody that dealt with a virgo or whatever this is yeah somebody here is going to be taught a very good lesson okay somebody here may take very good care of their their oral hygiene okay 
somebody is trying to conceal some type of exposed um, information or whatever this is. Somebody is trying to conceal their, their involvement or to some degree the information that is a part of this whole thing. All right. They don't want to look stupid or have their name out there or their reputation ruined because somebody goes around doing this to people. Okay. Let's see here. Oh, wow. All right. So we have puzzled, thrills, psychopath, karmic in reverse, and toxic. Somebody's envious of a person because they knew of how to um, prepare themselves to bring some sort of distance between them and a person. And I see that somebody here may not have the same um, opportunities in their career that they used to have while dealing with you. You were, you were an upgrade to somebody spiritually, physically, emotionally. And it looks like they showed themselves. Yeah, now somebody is hopeless, depressed. And I'm telling you, suicide came out, okay? Somebody is in the suicide state or wants to if they can't have you. Wants to be in this energy. I do see here that you have um, a cycle of toxic, psychopathic, unpredictable, abusive individuals that created a lot of drama and may have had arguments with you that led to physical encounters, okay? I feel like whoever this person is as the third party um, haters or somebody you were supposed to learn a karmic lesson from, it's time for you to learn them, Virgo. Do not repeat the same cycle thinking that somebody is gonna change because they're still the same, okay? Somebody is confused as to why someone is wired like that. It's not your job to try to figure it out. If you're not a scientist or somebody that works within, like, um, as a brain uh, specialist or, or whatever this is, it's not your job to figure someone out why, do we, why they are the way they are. You can't change this person. This is somebody that just likes to chase thrills, okay? I know everyone deserves... You know, um, it's like everybody deserves a, a second chance, but how many chances do you got to go through before um, somebody learns a lesson? This is just who somebody is. This is within their DNA. Whether they have spiritual um, warfare going on in their life or not, okay? We have um, exhaustion. So I feel like somebody here is trying to restore their energy so that they will keep from being de uh, depleted. Somebody here could be confused about why there needs to be um, an assertion to, to be apart from you, even though they have this chemistry, but they know damn well, you know, whatever they're feeding you is a fantasy because they have other people or you do. Take it as it resonates here. All right. Let's see here. Message for Virgo. Okay, so somebody here has a secret person or location that they chill with this person at. And it looks like they're uninterested and unbothered knowing that they're sleeping with other people and playing games with you. They don't care. They don't care. If you've been rejected, feel relieved. I know that's a hard pill to swallow, but you are free from this person being your burden, okay? There's somebody that could possibly be spreading tea, but whatever tea that you hear, you need to stay away from it because it might not even be true. Somebody could be trying to gaslight you with, with lies, okay? Somebody could have a sexual addiction that's causing them a lot of issues outside of you. 
and somebody feels like they've been alienated in a relationship, yeah, they use these things to try to love bomb you so that they feel in control. They're easily adaptable to new things and using politics to get their way. This is what this person does, or this is you. All right, let's see here. I was picking up the energy of Tarzan, so somebody could be muscular, okay, could be a jungle, a jungle type of person. Somebody wanna apologize here, but they don't have the courage to come back towards you. They're ashamed of what they might have done or what they were told to do, offer some, some finances. Okay, somebody here may have been under some sort of a delusion or um, there could have been illusions around a, a situation that somebody thought that it was okay to believe in this optimistic BS, okay, that they were going to persevere just to cause you some type of natural disaster here. Tell me more for daydream. What's this daydream card? In reverse, I'm getting uh, imagination. Somebody didn't imagine that what they daydreamed about or thought was going to push them forward to gain uh, or profit from something or uh, be concluded of their own issues. You're going to be retracting this from this person for you to get this good news it was yours in the first place somebody just masked themselves so they they can take something from you so that you would have bad luck but i feel like um the roles will be reversed onto this person and the person that they decide to be with next somebody's gonna run the same game that they ran on you number 61 and 63 could be significant these could be years okay What do we need to know for Virgo? Okay, so it looks like there's some sort of like unknowns going on in a marriage or somebody is um, on the, somebody could be holding off on, on proposing or something like that. I feel like work or, or whatever this is, is uh, stressful or there's a lot going on. Somebody wants to do something right. If they're gonna be committed to a person, tell me more about this marriage that's in the cross position. Okay, it looks like there's changes in a marriage that could be happening. Somebody's being honored at this time or carry some sort of honor because they don't let a lot uh, bother them. I feel like somebody's um, environment or the, the way that you live in society is gonna change as well. This could be because of a main male Tell me more about these changes and then we're going to get some other details. What's this change? Okay, so it looks like somebody is trying to conclude uh, something or, yeah, somebody's trying to figure out why why um, this, this privileged lady is, is somebody of privilege that's supposed to have changes happen uh, when it comes to maybe relocating moving or or going to a different site or job or whatever this is why is it holding back something you're supposed to receive okay there's a mature man that that may not be able to get out because you can't bail this person out somebody here is in prison spiritually, emotionally, there's a, a immature man that doesn't act his age, that is in, in bondage, but they're not telling you or they can't reach out to you for whatever reason. 
Somebody don't want you to be privileged. Somebody don't want you to have sudden wealth. They want you to be in bad health and they want to take anything that they can while you're you're sick. This is crazy. I I've, I've always told y'all this. These people are insane. What's the message here? Okay, so somebody lacks um, the ability to be whole with themselves since this, this exit of a relationship or connection. Somebody is unable to mimic or shape shift anybody but who they are, okay? And it mean, that means that they won't be able to have a conversation or a sit down with you to resume something. Somebody thought that they could use shape-shifting mechanisms or energy to get you to talk to them as somebody else or whatever this is. Somebody tried to get you comfortable so that they can pretend to be something other than who they are or what they appear to, to look like or something like that. Using that as a distraction. Why can't you just come as yourself? Whether, whether you choose not to see them or whatever this is, Virgo, we have entrapment in reverse and we have children. So somebody can entrap a person with a child or use a child as a pawn to, to gain trust or, or um, like comfort or whatever this is or to stay stuck with somebody I'm telling you it's something about you know this clingy nature to gain a proposal somebody can't use children or the fact that you are so they are so good with kids as a pawn to get what they want now somebody feels threatened or they will yeah, somebody here thinks that they they are a bozo. Somebody knows that they're a bozo, okay, and they're embarrassed to show their face because of them being caught up in, in toxic relationships and dealing with karmics. Okay, I'm hearing something about a bright stone or bright eyes or something like that. I don't think somebody wants to date a, a new person. message for Virgo. Oh, wow. Okay, so it looks like somebody's trying to make you look like you're the aggressor in a situation. It could be a Hispanic, masculine, or feminine. Somebody that you live around or somebody that could be a neighbor. It looks like it's a karmic family member of yours. Okay, there is an ultimatum that a karmic family member has for you to follow. We have the letter W, okay? Somebody here could have the letter W in their name, first, last, or middle. Somebody is encouraging sociopathic behaviors or whatever this is. Okay, so t child endangerment. Somebody here needs to make sure that their kids are safe or what your children are doing for money is safe. Yeah, somebody here could be asked out on a date as a child or somebody is acting childish to be able to lure a child, borrowing a car. Somebody here has a loaner vehicle. Okay, this person could appear as extremely petty. Okay, somebody could be um, headed to a, uh, a cabin or a cottage or something like that. Somebody's name could be Roy, R-O-Y. What's the message? What is it that we need to know? Somebody's name could have the letter N in it, whether it's the beginning, in the middle, or the end. Okay, so we do have car broke down. Somebody here could have uh, car issues. Okay, somebody could be spiritually hating on you because your light shows them their deep uh, demons here. Treat yourself. 
There could be family domestic disputes because they're, you're not in agreement with this person or you don't agree to what somebody is doing. They could be working in the industrial and manufacturing um, industry. Yeah, somebody is being confronted about some type of uh, STD or STI or results from the doctors or something like that here. I'm gonna pull one more set of cards. Okay, somebody is working through some sort of sex addiction. Okay, I do believe I do believe that um, somebody is unable to get an answer out of you on social media. I'm telling you, somebody is digging for uh, some sort of answers about your spiritual alignment or connection to the divine. And it's like you're moving in silence. Okay, somebody can't get any direct answers out of you or somebody wants you to be able to speak freely so they can cock block, but it's not working. Anyways, Virgo, that's what I have here <clears throat> for your current messages. Hopefully it resonates. If it does, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, stay blessed. And I will see you guys in the next one.